What is the best breakfast food? Pancakes. Pancakes. Really? You would take... I love waffles, but right now I'm feeling a pancake. Look at that butter. I know. For those of you listening... You see what we're looking at. Well, if they get on YouTube and type in ER Comedy... You can find full episodes of this podcast, full video episodes of this podcast, and people can follow along with us if they'd so choose. <laughs> but um, I didn't include French toast in there. Does French toast wave your answer? See, I didn't do it because I just don't think that it's playing for mm -hmm. keeps. I think that in the breakfast world, when it comes to a buttery, syrupy hunk of yeah. Carbs. The, it really is two camps. There's waffles and pancakes. I don't think French toast even really belongs no. in the conversation. Like, yeah, it's okay. It's an acceptable third. But it's it's not playing for... I do love waffles. I used to love waffles more than pancakes, but I don't know what has changed. The pancakes are... I think I'm going to go with a pancake because when you get to the center of a pancake... Yeah where the butter has been sitting mm -hmm. and a little bit of syrup gets on top and it's just real soft and real. Ooh, that's a, Delicioso. that is a game changer right there. Waffles can be overdone too. Yeah. They can be hard. Yeah. Plus I do feel as though you put a lot more syrup on a waffle than you do mm -hmm. on a pancake because you got to fill in all the little crevice yeah, crevasses. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, and then, it's not like it evenly spreads. Like, it'll mm -hmm. fill up one one part of the waffle, and it doesn't overflow into the other compartments. So you could have a, a chunk of a waffle that's, like, the sweetest thing you've ever eaten in your life, and then the next bite yeah. is bone dry. Yeah. And I just, I mean, it's yeah. a structural thing, honestly. I mean, it, it's that's where it's flawed. Whereas a pancake, it can spread evenly. Mm-hmm. Right. I also feel the need when I eat a waffle to cut it along the lines. <laughs> I know. That's your OCD. 